Go and play. Crazy. You gotta take Whitney up. You got. You gotta go with Whitney up. So, uh, now I think that might be my. Limit. You only said that because Luke in the house. I was riding with the Dolphins all the way. I know a little bit about him, man. I love Earth, Wind, and Fire. You know what I'm saying? This is one of the most famous songs from that group, uh, uh, Shining Star. And when you know about the shining stars you know that we speak to student athletes from the chicago and surrounding areas we talk to these athletes about their accomplishments and joining us now is one of the coolest cats i've seen in high school basketball he's number 24 on your roster he comes to us he's a shining star but we're gonna call him a shooting star none other we like to welcome lucas williamson to the high school holla h2s2 show welcome luke hey how are y'all doing hey man we are fantastic we got you well i like to call him cool hand luke and i see why you know what i'm saying the way he strokes it you know what i'm saying from from that outside yeah i feel you i feel you you know what i'm saying cool hand all day long and not only that if you need a buzzer beater Put it in the hands of Cool Hand Luke. He gonna give it to you. Uh, I, hey Luke, I'm gonna let you have that one, Lucas. I'm gonna let you have that one. You can take that to college with you. You can take that to college with you. Let's talk about how you got started in the love of basketball, man. Uh, well, it was my dad. Uh, he was the one that put the ball into my head at a super young, like a ridiculously young age. And he was the one that got me up at 8 o'clock going to the YMCA before the before the grown man got in and they would start scrimmaging because they would kick me off the court. Mm -hmm. But it was him. He would, he would just make me work out, and I just fell in love with it ever since. I mean, did he did he also uh, instill the work ethic? Yes. Yeah. They say hard work beats talent when talent doesn't work hard. Exactly. Man, Luke is not only cool; he's a scholar. <laughs> I hear you, Luke. What made you choose Whitney Young? Um, I felt like Whitney Young, like fit me who I am. Uh, it has the, the best. What I feel it has one of the best uh, academic schools in the city, and the athletics are. Definitely stellar, so I felt like it was an obvious pick for me. Now, you obviously are playing for um, one of the well-renowned renowned coaches in high school basketball, Coach Tyrone Slaughter. How is it playing for him? Uh, I love it. Um, it's always welcoming knowing that you're playing for a coach that truly supports you and, and, is, and is invested in your process. Um, he's always believed in me, always put me in opportunities where I could only succeed, and all I had to do was just put the ball in the basket, and that's what I know best. I'm sitting around here calling him Cool Hand Lucas. <laughs> but what do people normally call you? Um, I got a nickname freshman year. It's kind of like ridiculous. It's called Pook. People just call me Pook, P-O-O-K. Um, I don't know why. Um, one of the seniors on the team, Paul White, he just like was messing around with my name. He just said, like, Pook is Pook. Pook and it just stuck yeah, ever since. Hey, hey, uh, uh, CW, he say Pook. Pook. Yep. And he even spelled it for you. Okay. Yeah, okay. It's not a U-K-E. It's not a U-K-E. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a U-K-E. <laughs> Pook. 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 All right, so that's what the team senior called you. Yeah. All right, what does the family call you? They call me Blue. Like, no, not Luke. No, 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 Luke or Pook. You know we got some, yeah, your parents in the, Listen, in the studio I now. Know, I want to know. We, we'll find out your, the truth. What did your auntie, grandma, and they'll call uh -huh. you. That's it. Yeah, there you go. Uh, there you, you had to go deep on right, the Right, right. My auntie, my auntie calls me Lil Bit because I guess my dad is Big Bit now. But when, <laughs> when when he was a kid, like my age, they called him Lil Bit, but they can't, can't call him Lil Bit anymore because he's old. So <laughs> I guess. Hey, I yeah, but we didn't right, say that. We didn't right, say right, that. Right, we didn't say that. We didn't say that. <laughs> So, little bit. Right, little bit. We got little bit. We got Pook. 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 P O O K. OK. And we got Cool Hand Lou. Cool Hand Lou. Right. And Luke, you might want to go with mine. Cool. Man, I don't know. I, you know, I'm going to have to take a page out of George Lucas and call you uh, Luke Skywalker. Luke Skywalker. Right. You know, you ah, hey, man. when you get out here in the next round, Use the force, Luke. <laughs> <laughs> Did you hear me come with that one right there? I'll forgive you that one. Give me that one. I'll forgive you that one. 
So look, we talked about everything about the love of basketball. Let's talk about the classroom, man. Mm -hmm. We know that Whitney Young is known for its academics. Yeah. Exactly. So do you have a particular class that you uh, are more interested in? Mm -hmm. um, the science, science, the science classes that I've taken, specifically uh, chemistry and physics. I don't know why, but I'm actually really good at it, and um, I've actually been really interested in it. So those those two are actually my strongest subjects in my four years. That's right. what I like to hear. Luke is showing off. Yeah, yeah. I think I think, I think <laughs> he's showing off. Yeah, so, yeah. yeah. Like, I mean, you know, my favorite class was lunch. Exactly. <laughs> Luke you is know, showing man. off. See the. I had an AP, I had an AP in, in recess. Mm -hmm. How do you balance basketball and school? Is it is it a tough job? Uh it can get a bit overwhelming at times, but uh, you just got to stay focused. You know, sometimes when your friends are going out, you might not be able to go out because you got a test the next day right, or you right. got homework that you got to do. You just got to stay focused on your goal and know that not everybody is on your path. Cool hey. man, Luke, man. I'm telling you. Tellin you. He, got the, he got the force, Luke. I'm telling you, he's a Jedi. I'm going to go out there and get me a number 24, <laughs> Jerry. You might as well. <laughs> <laughs> now, Luke, yeah. we talked about the classroom. Mm -hmm. What's some of the things you're doing around the community, either Whitney Young or your own neighborhood? Anything you do outside of basketball in school? Yeah, well, you know, Whitney Young, they make you do, um, I think it's 40 hours of service. Oh, I didn't in know In the that. community yeah, before what, you graduate. Now. The kids gotta do community yeah. service when they get up out of there. Right, now, now hold on, Luke. Yeah. Somebody in the studio, said that like he knew that all the time. Well, you know, you, know, you have <laughs> Now, I don't I, now one of us didn't know that. I, I admit, I didn't know that Whitney Young did that. Well, you know. But uh, the other co-host, Luke, he didn't know that. Well, throughout my professional career, <laughs> uh, you know, community <laughs> the public, I've had to deal with a number of you that let me know that this is a requirement. Okay, it's not about you, it's about Luke. <laughs> <laughs> so what else, Luke? You know, so yeah, I do help out in the community a lot and do try to do different things. Um, I would like to be more involved in church on Sundays, but you know, the travel and, and the, we, sometimes we got games on Sunday, so it's kind of hard to do it all at the same time. What you got a favorite player? Who do you follow your game? Now? Oh, my favorite player. Well, my favorite, one of my favorite players of all time would be Dwayne Wade. I mean, he's around my size, mm -hmm. height wise. You know, I've got to get bigger. Uh, but don't worry about it, Luke. You know, <laughs> I, I, he, he's about right. my size too. <laughs> right, right, right. Ain't that no? But I feel like. His longevity of his career is, is, is changed, and I want to, you know, of course, everybody wants to play a, a long, longer career, and I want to do some of the types of things that he does, and his mid-range game is pretty solid, so that's one of my strengths in my game also. Same thing with DeMar DeRozan. Um, oh, yeah, that's yeah, another good one. That's another good Mid-range killer, so. Well, he, those are two good ones. And, they, and they say we get the, we get the uh, mid-range game back. You're in your senior year, correct? Yes. And are there any particular schools that you're looking at? Yes, uh, there's, uh, there's a lot of schools that's coming in because I haven't signed. Uh, I didn't sign early, uh, but my top three right now would be UIC, uh, Northern Illinois, and Hofstra. This is in New York. Those are the three schools that have been showing uh, most interest. All good schools. Right. All right. great schools, I like, man. I like that Hofstra, though. I like that Hofstra. Uh, you just like New York. I, I like that academics, though. You know. Yeah, Hofstra is up there, man. Hey, you up there. And look, you go up there, you might see us visiting from time right, to time. You know what I, mean? I mean, we'll be covering the game. Exactly. That's what I meant. Right. Yeah, you know, we'll be up there covering the game. <laughs> now, we got Luke's uh, parents here. Uh -oh. We got the parents yeah. here. So, I heard you, you put, if, if, the, if Dad put the ball in Luke's hand, Louisa, you have to be extremely proud of your kids, man. They, they're doing some awesome things. Yes, I am. Of course I am. Tell everybody who you are and say your hellos. Um, I'm Lauren. I'm Lucas's uh, sister. and I'm very proud of my brother. And I just want to give a huge shout out to all my best friends back at Whitney Young. And they're always supporting me doing my thing. And then they come out to support my brother, too. You got to make this work. I'm going to put the pressure on you. You got to make this work, Luke. Gotcha. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> it's amazing how Luke left the part out about the belt, though. Right, right. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> man, great job. Great job. Thank you for having me. We'll email. Hey, um, we got to get him to coach you the time. Uh, 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 u